Hello everybody. This is a high pressure sodium area light, which looks like a street light, but it's technically an area light because it is in the middle of this field in Washington Crossing Park, which is used for expedition purposes. I hope to be able to film it as well as perhaps an area light on that barn over there turn on as it gets darker out. Sun setting right now, but I'm hoping within 15 or 20 minutes it will come on. You can see that there's a birdhouse. There are actually two birdhouses, I think. On the side of the pole where the light is. Here it comes. A lot of times, high pressure sodium lights are blue when they start up, but it looks like this one warms up fairly quickly. You may have seen it glow blue very briefly, but it doesn't take long at all for this kind of light, for this particular light to warm up. And I think that's because it is a newer light. I think it was installed in 2013, so it is much newer than other high-pressure sodium lights. These types of lights, I think, are becoming less common since more efficient technology like LEDs and induction lamps are becoming far more dominant. But for some reason, they chose to put a high-pressure sodium lamp here. This replaced a mercury vapor lamp and in the beginning it was only activated when there was an event going on here like the annual engine show antique show in September but they seem to have it hooked up all the time here zoom out see it doesn't take long for this to re light to reach full brightness